Mr. Aaron, is there anything you wish to say before I impose the agreed upon sentence? The sentence of the court on your plea of guilty to murder in the second degree is 25 years to life. On kidnapping in the second degree, 15 years in jail, followed by five years post-release supervision. These sentences shall run consecutive, meaning a minimum of 40 years before you would be eligible for parole. There is no way one can comprehend or understand the pain of losing a child. Esther and I faced this unspeakable tragedy last year when our little boy, Libby, was ruthlessly taken from us. Today, my family has finally received some partial closure on one aspect of this nightmare. Levi Aaron, as a child and a young man, should have been treated for his mental illness. His case, not parenthetically, is also an indictment of denial. Levi Aaron, while incarcerated, must be protected so that his sentence is not transmuted into a death penalty. Take charge of this. I think when a uh, parole board, uh, you know, looks at the crime and looks at the details of what this person did, the murder, and the details of what this individual did, I don't believe any parole board will ever uh, let this guy go free. He is embarrassed, he is remorseful, and he's shameful of what happened in this case. Making a statement, no matter how many times he says he's sorry, is only going to seem insincere or never going to be enough. So at this time, he's chosen not to make a statement because he doesn't feel as if his apology will really get the weight of what he means it to have.